Hey everybody, Anne here, and I know you might think I'm obsessed with these clams, but you know what? I found another thing to make with them. Poor man's clam scampi. Here we go. All right, y'all, I'm bored. I got me some more clams, I got them boiling. And I'm gonna make me some clam ramen. Not with red wine, but with white wine. Add a little garlic and some ghee. Let's see how this turns out. Here we go, clams all done. Let's rinse them off with some cold water and get them out of their shells. Hey, I got the clams in there and a little bit of white wine. You didn't see me pour it in there, but trust me, there's some white wine in there and a couple tablespoons of ghee. Now, I am going to take the seasoning packet from the ramen and I got the shrimp, shrimp flavor. I'm going to put that in there. I might need two hands for this. Come on, shrimp flavoring, go in there. Very good. And I, of course, have to add a little bit extra garlic. I don't think I need to add extra salt because there's plenty in the shrimp ramen seasoning. And we are gonna just stir this up. And I'm gonna let it cook for a little bit. Let's get my new, oh, I dropped the spoon. Yikes! I'll set it off to the side. Mmm. 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 That tastes good already. That ghee. Mmm. Tastes good. Alrighty. I got me another single burner st uh, butane stove. No. Yeah. Butane. Let's go ahead and start this baby up. Put it on medium. And I am going to cook it for a little while until it starts kind of softly boiling. And then I'm going to add just a little bit of water and my ramen noodles and we're going to see how this tastes. This is a poor man's clam scampi. Yeah, that's what I'm going to call it. Poor man's clam scampi. <laughs> Look at those delicious clams. Let me taste a little bit of the juice just to see what it's going to be like. Oh my god. This is going to be so, so good. All right, I am going to add a little bit of water. Don't know how much. Yeah, that looks good. Uh, and then, oh, I need to grab these noodles. And I'm just going to throw these babies right on in there. Oops, hold on. Come on, Roman noodles. <laughs> there we go. Poor man scampi, right on. All right, I don't know if I have enough water in there or not. You know what, I think I do. Um, because I don't want there to be a whole lot of water left over. I tell you what, I am gonna add just a little bit more water. A little bit more. And I can let it boil down if I need to. All right, so let's get this back up to a boil. And before long, I'm going to have clam scampi. Right on. All right, the ramen noodles are cooking down. They are pretty much done. I'm going to go ahead and let some of this extra water cook off. And then I'm going to plate it up. And hopefully this is going to be delicious. I know it's going to be delicious. I just know it is. All right, it's plated up. It's ready to be tasted. There was a little bit more. It Kind of spilled over the bowl a little bit. Let me just try some noodles first and see how it is. It's going to be hot. I bet you it's going to be super hot. Let me just get a little bit of noodles and try them. Oh my goodness. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. Delicious. Noodles are delicious. Let's see what the clams are like. Need a couple clams and a little bit of noodles. Oh, noodles are falling off. That's okay. Mmm. Clams are great. Oh, they absorb that ghee. Oh, and I was, when I was boiling them, I boiled them with a little bit of lemon juice as well. Not gritty at all. Of course, I had soaked them for like two days <laughs> to get all the grit out. This is delicious. And all it is is a packet of shrimp ramen noodles, freshwater clams from the river, 
ghee, and some garlic, and that's it. So you know what? This gets a big man hand. Thumbs up. Right on. Look at this dog. She wants some of this so bad. So bad. Should I give it to her? I don't know. Should I give it to her? I shouldn't taunt her, right? All right. Maybe I'll take one more bite and then see if she likes it. I don't know, though. This broth is so good. Mmm. Oh, my God. It's just barely tangy. But you you taste the buttery flavor from the ghee coming in. And then the, the shrimp seasoning from the ramen packet. Oh, my goodness. Mmm. Oh, it is so good. Man, I wish there was a way I could preserve these clams so I can make this in the winter. Because this is going to make... This really would make an awesome, awesome cold winter dish. Mm-mm-mm. Alright, she's been a really good girl. She has not tried to eat any of this before she was supposed to. So guess what? She gets the rest. It might be a little hot, girlfriend. So be careful. Yep, yep. Be careful. Be careful. Let's see if she likes it. A little bit hot. A little bit hot. Just take a little bit at a time. All right. Let's let this cool off a little bit. All right. There. I added some cold water to it, and now she is totally digging it. That's her dinner. Yeah. See, I've lost. Let's see. I think I've lost about 54 pounds, and it's the Pitbull diet, basically. That is, my Pitbull gets half of everything I make. <laughs> and she loves it. I don't give her any bad stuff. I mean, I, I don't give her anything with, um, like, chocolate or with, like, really spicy peppers or with, uh, 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 like, onions in it. But this, she loves it. And don't worry about the wine. The wine had already been boiled off, the alcohol content in it. And this is delicious. I mean, you could tell. This Betty, she does not eat anything unless it's good. I mean, shoot, she would not even drink water if she felt it wasn't fresh enough. I have to give her fresh water. I mean, of course, everybody does. But she knows. She knows if it's more than a day old in her bowl. So there you go. Poor man's clam scampi. He was a success. Never underestimate the diversity of ramen. There's so many different ways you can use it, and it's cheap. You can get six packs for a dollar at the dollar store. And it comes in a ton of different flavors, so you can add things to it, or you can just eat it alone. I've always really liked it. I don't know. Maybe I'm weird. It sure did give this dish a lift, so I hope you try this recipe sometime. And you're going to have to go hunting for clams, but I guarantee you, you will not regret it. It was great. Great. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.